We've been running the Ready for Work programme since 2001 and we run it in partnership with Business in the Community and it's a programme that's aimed at helping vulnerable people. In particular, we have decided to target and to focus ex-offenders. Um, we did this because over nine million people in the UK have a criminal conviction. Three quarters of businesses use a criminal conviction in order to discount a candidate. So these people really need extra help getting into work. They're very supportive yeah, and, and they do every day. They will call you, especially if you've got your training. Every morning you'll get a text from Laura or Sarah to wake you up, to be there on time. Um, well, they gave me a buddy, um, someone I could you know, uh, go to as a point of reference for everything I needed. Um, they introduced me to all the teams that I'd be working with. Uh, they bought me a suit as well to, to make me fit straight into the environment because I didn't have a suit at the time and I felt very underdressed as well. For me personally, the Ready for Work programme is the one um, that really kind of, that I get, that I really understand. I can see the benefits so clearly. Um, the people that we work with on the programme are all so fantastic. I feel really proud. I know that I've changed as a person through kind of running this programme and getting to know people and understanding some of the issues that people face. Um, so yeah, I've really kind of changed my view of a lot of things. <laughs> well, the fact that they take on people like me, you know, ex-offenders, is, is just ironic that an ex-offender would be working in one of the biggest law firms in the world. And I still have to pinch myself every day coming in, you know, thinking it's all going to end, thinking that they haven't really realised, but they, they do know that and they're willing to support people who've got convictions or spent convictions, you know, and give them a chance. So that's the amazing thing that I, I think makes them different from everybody else.